Gareth, you went from being able to drive a manual car, but because of your injury, you were only thereafter able to use an automatic vehicle. In early February of this year, you already had a vehicle. What was it? Um, I had a Ford Focus. Well, that's all fine, but you're getting a bigger family, right? And your business as well, which is what, madam? What's the business? We um, do catering. We own a cafe. You were looking for a bigger vehicle, and you came across a Renault Scenic at Cal's... I'm going to say his forecourt. Is that right? Yes, sir. Did you see any of his vehicles advertised online before you saw it on the forecourt? Yes, sir. Now, it says a number of things. It certainly says it's in good condition, correct? True. £3,695. It was well within your budget, right? Yes, yeah. yes sir. Well, you don't know whether it was in their budget. I'm asking them. <laughs> you went and took the vehicle. Did you test drive it? Uh, I, I did say yes. Were you satisfied with it? I was, sir, yes. You looked under the bonnet and did all of that sort of thing? Yes, sir. And you came to an arrangement. The selling price was £3,695. You did a deal, correct? How much did you offer for it? Uh, 3500 sir. Was there a sticker in the window? Not that I recall, sir, no. Was there a sticker on the car? No, there wasn't, no. Thank you very much. Was there anything about warranties discussed at the time you agreed to pay £3,500? Yes, sir. I asked, I asked what would my assurances be with regarding the car, and he said that the car would be... The car's absolutely fine. It's had a perfect checkover. It's had a service. It's had its MOT. I had a look as well in the meantime on Carl's website. On his actual website, it says about warranties, uh, something I, I can't honestly remember, I've wrote it down, something with regards to that all car sales come with a warranty. Here's the problem. It says at the point of sale when brought at the screen price. Screen price is very interesting because it could mean two things. It could mean, couldn't it, computer screen, or it could mean the screen on a car. And in law, that creates a problem. According to the computer screen price, which you personally saw, it was £3,695. Well, you have paid under that sum. You haven't paid the computer screen price. Therefore, how are you automatically supplied with a warranty? Yeah, but I did offer him warranty with 100 quid extra with six months warranty, which he refused to take it. I, I think that Cal should have said that the, the warranty didn't apply in that case if I was prepared to accept less. I, I believe that, sir. Also, um, it did have, offer me extended warranty. Let me help you. I told you that there were two common understandings of the word screen. Did you buy this purely by looking at the computer screen? No, sir. You went and saw the windscreen, I would have thought. And any common understanding and objective assessment of what that word screen means means the sticker price in the window of the car on the windscreen, correct? Correct, sir. Did you pay under the windscreen price? No, sir, there was no windscreen price. Voila! <laughs> Problem solved. Now, we can fast forward in this regard because you got the car, it drove fine, first of all, then what happened? Um, well, I was at the shop and the car, the car stalled and it came up with an engine failure. So I checked the oils, um, not knowing much myself, but I wanted to make sure that I'd done everything OK. Uh, I messaged my wife and said, look, there's something wrong with the car. We proceeded to carry on that way because it wasn't every day at that time. Understood. In mid-March, you were using the car as well. That's correct, isn't it, Jenna? Yes. And you were at a very busy interchange when something happened. What happened, please, Jenna? I was pulling out of a crossroad because there was room in between cars and the car stopped in the middle of the road and I nearly had another car going into me, but I had my baby in the back. I couldn't get the car to start. I had to fully shut the engine down and I was stuck for a good couple of minutes before it started up again. Your wife and child were very nearly involved in a very serious accident. That's got to affect you in a way that would affect, certainly more deeply, another person. Correct? Correct, sir, yes. If you enjoyed that video, then I strongly suggest clicking here for more highlights. For those of you who haven't subscribed yet, and why not, so that you never miss out, subscribe, clicking down there. That's an order.